Hello, hello, everybody. Nice to have you one more time. Welcome, welcome. I think here we have some of you are here. It's nice to have you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's nice to have you. Hello, hello. Okay, we're gonna wait for your classmates, Laura. Hello, how are you? Good evening, welcome. Everything good? Oh yeah, that's expensive. That's expensive. You see, you're rich, right? You got a bunch of money here. Yeah? Because this is like personal classes, right? Just for you. Just for you. Thank you so much, Laura, for being here. It's nice to have you one more time, as you may know. Oh, okay. Okay. Good then. Stephanie also is here. Hi, Stephanie. Good evening, Stephanie. Welcome. It's nice to have you. Hello, hello, Stephanie. Hello, this is in. Hello, Stephanie. Welcome. How are you? Everything good? We're just waiting for your classmates so they can join us today. Stephanie. Oh, that's, that's Hello, Mr. Like. Hello. How are you? Mama. Mama. Pretty good. Hello. I'm great. Oh, you have you have a daughter. Yes or no? You have a daughter, right? Yes or no? Thank you so much. Oh, look at this. Hmm. Okay. Oh, this is Wednesday the 7th. Today. Wednesday the 7th. Okay. Here we have also Stephanie. Oh, just, just girls right now in the class. Amazing. Thank you so much, people, for me. We just want to wait for your classmates so they can join us. Okay. Beautiful day. Just Wednesday. Nice to have you. One more time. I wish you the best. We have Carla, Carolina. Let me show you what we're going to do today. So, um, oh my God, what is this then? Come on, man, please. Okay, so this is going to be um, section number five, which is the one we're working this week. And the name of this, tell me about your family. We have I come from a big family, quantifiers. That is the thing we are going to have uh, on today's class. Also, we're going to have a short review on yesterday's topic, which is present continuous. And this, this is pre intermediate number one, and this is class number 15. So uh, this is going to be today's agenda. People. So welcome, it's nice to have you, everybody. Oh, yeah, this is gonna be today's agenda. Um, I just have a incident, that's rare. Let me check, let me check. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay. So I okay, it's rare. Um, hmm. Um, let me take the addendums really quick. Um, okay, I will just check the ones that we have here in the class because uh, the rest are like of uh, the people are absent today. So I will just just Alison Celaya. Present teacher. Thank you, Alison. Very good. Then I have um, Laura Molina, right? Present. Laura Molina, let me check. Laura. Oh, what is your first name? Laura. 
Laura, what's what's your first name? Because I don't I don't I don't I don't find it here. Find it. Here. No aparece. Yes, but I don't find you your first name. What is your first name? Laura. Oh, Laura Molina. Yes, I got you. Sorry. Yes. Okay. Um, Karen. Karen Garcia, right? Present. Thank you so much, Karen. Um, Stephanie Quintanilla. Stephanie Quintanilla. Welcome, Stephanie. I'm here, Mr. Um, Daniela Asensio. You hear right there. Present. Daniela Asensio. Okay. Thank you. Present. Thank you so much, Daniela. Carla Colocho is here. I'm here. No, I will do it. I will do it one by one because it's taking too much time. Okay. Uh, Alison, you're here, right? Ana Marisol Zamora? No? Okay. Um, Andrea Represa? No? Okay. Uh, Andrea Vanessa Landos? No? Okay. Bárbara Cabrera? Bárbara? No? Okay. Uh, Carolina del Carmen Pérez. Present teacher. Thank you, Carolina. Claudia López. No. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Claudia. Welcome. Um, Cristina Monge. Cristina. No. Okay. Chris. Cristina Monge. Cristina Monge, no? Okay, what about Carolina del Carmen Perez? You're here, Carolina? Yes. Present. Thank you so much. I'm sorry, I missed your name. Um, Edgar. Hello, Edgar. No? Ernesto Ventura. Hello? No? Okay, Griselda Moreno. Hello, Griselda. No? Okay, uh, Ivania Mendoza, no? Jennifer Torres, no? Um, Jennifer Paola Moss, Jennifer Paola Moss, no? Jennifer Marroquín, no? Uh, Jocelyn Mancia. I'm here, teacher. Perfect, thank you. Karen Garcia. Karen Garcia, no? Okay, uh, Carla Colocho, you're here, right? I'm Love here. Her. You're here. Leslie. Leslie? Present. Thank you, Leslie. Uh, Lisbeth? No, Lisbeth today? Okay. Uh, Lorena del Carmen Hernandez? Here, teacher. Perfect, wonderful. Nice to have you. Lucia Cepeda? Hello, hello, Lucia. Are you here? No? Okay. Uh, Mayra Mendez. Mayra Mendez. No. Okay. Um, Raul Reyes. No. Okay. Um, Dalila. Hello, Dalila. No. Okay. Um, Ruth del Carmen, chicas. No. Okay. And the last one is Quintanilla. This is Stephanie. <laughs> I'm here. I'm here, teacher. Thank you, Stephanie. Karen. Okay, Edgar. Okay, Karen Garcia. Let me check. Garcia. Karen Garcia, right? Teacher. Yes. A mí no me mencionó. Excuse me, what's your name? Brenda Isabel Castro. Brenda. Okay, Brenda. I'm sorry, Brenda. I apologize. 
Okay. Uh, Teacher, ya soy por acá. Ana Marisol. Ana Marisol. Let me get you here. Represa, right? No, Zamora. Oh, Zamora. Okay. Ana Marisol. Oh, got it. Got you here. Thank you so much. Also, Edgar, you told me that you're here, right, Edgar? And you have just, you just listen to the class. Very good. Uh, some of you also, uh, Andrea Landos and Ana Marisol. Someone. Okay, very good. Landos. Let me check here really quick. Okay, so let me show you what's gonna be to give me a minute. This is gonna be today's agenda. I'm sorry, there's a dog barking like next to my house. I apologize. Okay, so we're gonna have a short review on yesterday's topic, okay, which is which is this one. Okay, yesterday we were working about simple present. Okay, just take a look on this one. We have simple present tense. Um, I'm sorry, simple present continuous. So that's what we have in here, okay? Um, if you see on the top here, we have the short explanation about the grammar part. And then we're gonna have some exercises just for you have a little bit of grammar content here. Okay, I will ask Laura, can you help me reading Laura? The um, grammar content, please, can you read this part? Como dice teacher? Can you, can you read this part, please? Can you read this part? Uh, read, I need you to todo, read. Todo. No, solo esta parte de aquí, just this part. No sé si la ve en pantalla. Uh, eh, la primera. Yes, please, thank you. Use the present continuous to talk about action that are happening now. Uh, what are you doing this day? I am uh, studying English. Yes, continue, Laura. Very good. Okay. The present continuous is present of B plus ENG for birds handing in. If drop the an an al in in he have having live living uh, for yes, birds. Please. Continue, please. Sorry. For birds, handing in vowel as consonant, double the consonant and um, add. E ENG sit sitting. Thank you so much. Very good. So in the first one, we have like how do we use this thing, right? Things that are happening now. Like, for example, what are the things that you're doing these days? Right. Um, like I'm studying English today and also tomorrow, right? With some grammar words like the present, we have some verse ending in letter E, like have and live. What we do with these verbs, we delete the letter E and we add ing, and then we have have, having, live, living. And there are some special verbs like we double the consonant. Okay. When we have vowel plus consonant. Okay. And then we have a double consonant like sit, sitting. Also, we have another one that is called, uh, let me show you, run. Okay. That is another one. Also, we have swim, swim, okay. Entonces, con esto, ¿qué es lo que hacemos? Le ponemos double consonant y luego ing. Run, I'm running, okay. Yes, swim, we have swimming. Yeah, we double the consonant and we add ing at the end. Yes, with this word. What are you going to do in the following exercise? If you see here, 
you need to use these verbs to complete the sentence, okay? To complete the sentence. Also, you have some information in parentheses. Para formular, yes, la question, okay? Primero dice, write questions with the words in parentheses in the present continuous. Entonces, vea la information que tiene in the parentheses para crear questions. Después que crea las questions, utiliza these verbs para responder those questions. Yes? Yes? Alison, do you understand? Andrea Landos, do you understand? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect, perfect, okay? So this is the way we are going to do it. One more time, one more time. Vea la información that you have in parentheses to make questions. Lo primero que va a hacer es utilizar la information in parentheses to make questions. Cuando ya haga las questions, utilice estos verbs in, in, the, in this chart to answer those questions. Yes? I will give you five minutes to do this one and then participation. Yes? Ready? Let's work. If you si no entiende, let me know. Or if you do not understand or if you don't get it, let me know. Thank you so much. Teacher, no puedo ver nada en la pantalla. ¿Ahora? No, se ve oscuro. Le voy a mandar una captura. Let me send you the picture. Let me send you the picture so you can have it. Okay. Let me send you the picture in the chat for the ones that like are not able to see the picture. So you can you can have it and, and do it. Okay, um, just give me a minute because I'm using my Aracatel just to take the picture. Okay, just give me a minute. I have it ready for you. Yes. Okay. Give me a minute. Oh, come on, man. What's happening with this Aracatel? Doesn't work. Oh, okay, I think there we have it. Check the chat on soon. I think it's available there. Um, okay, check the chat soon, and I will like like share again uh, the presentation. If you can, if you see it, like if you're able to see it, that's wonderful for you. But if not, you can check the chat soon so you can have the exercise. Okay, and if you have a question, again, I'm here. Just let me know. This is about yesterday, yesterday's um, content, which is present on Twitter. If you finish with this, raise your hand so you can participate. And I can hear your participation here in class about this one. This is about, again, present continuous and how do we use it? Okay, in, in parentheses, you have some vocabulary that you need to like use to make a question, yeah? Don't forget that we use the verb to be with present continuous, yes? Uh, 
you, if you have a question, let me know anytime. Let me, let me change my name because I have the light. Yeah. One more time when you finish, raise your hand so I can hear your sentences. Um, Lorena, thank you so much. Here, teacher. Letter. Letter A and B. Oh, yes, yes, please. Yes, okay. What your sister doing these days? She is teaching English. Really? Where is she living? I know, is she living abroad? Yes, she is. She is living in South Korea. South Korea. South Korea. Beautiful. South Korea. Perfect, South Korea. Okay. Very good. Great job. Yeah, that's the way. Present continuous, verb to be. Great job. Thank you so much, Lorena. Somebody else? We have exercise number two. Somebody else with exercise number two? Mm -hmm. And again, if you have a question at home or si no entiende esto, let me know. So I can, again, we can practice a little bit more on this one. This present continuous is about everything you do at the moment or the things that you do this way, right? These days, you can use present continuous to talk about it. Yep. Yeah, because this in um, exercise number two, when you're ready, raise your hand so you can participate. Thank you, Stephanie, please. Okay, the number two is how are you spending your summer? I'm spending part-time. I work in two classes also. Okay, okay. So the first one is how are you spending your summer? Yes? Yes, how are you spending your summer? Okay, what is, what is letter B? I... I spending or oh, I am spending. Um, no, I'm sorry. That is I mean, the first one is correct. The question is correct. But if you notice here tenemos the expression part time. relacionada con esto verbos Working. Okay. Exactly. Working part time. I'm working part time. Very good. Uh, and and aquí, what is next? Are you studying? Um, while working. Uh, taking. And, exactly. Taking. Very good. I'm taking two classes also. I'm taking two classes also. Okay. Very good. Okay. What about this one? What about this one? 
What are you taking? Yes. My friend and I studying photograph in Japanese. We like all classes a lot. Okay, le falta el verbo to be. ¿Cuál es el verbo to be que le falta ahí? Are. My friend and I are. Are studying photograph in Japanese. We like all classes a lot. Very good. Exactly. That is the way. That is for good. The way. Don't forget the, the, um, the verb to be with present. Thank you so much. Very good, Stephanie. Great job. Okay, people, I hope you finish at home with this uh, little exercise. And now we're going to get into the next thing, which is a conversation. I will play the audio for this conversation. Okay, and then we can practice in pairs. Okay, I will give you some time so you can practice. I will play the audio twice. And then you will get into the breaker room so you can practice this conversation and then we can get back to the main room. Okay, let's listen and watch. Hello, do you come from a big family? Listen to Meili and Marcus talk about their families. I come from a big family. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, I'm an only child. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days. But big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. How many brothers and sisters do Meili and Marcos have? Type your answers on a discussion box. Hello, do you come from a big family? Listen to Meili and Marcos talk about their families. I come from a big family. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, I'm an only child. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days. But big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. How many brothers and sisters do Meili and Marcos have? Type your answers on a discussion box. Okay, what are you going to do now? is you are going to practice this conversation, okay? I send you the uh, conversation in the chat on WhatsApp so you can have it, okay? Voy a abrir los breaker rooms. Usted va a trabajar con un partner y va a practicar this conversation. Le voy a dar 10 minutes so you can do it, okay? It's going to be random people. En la sesión principal voy a tener a Laura y voy a tener a Claudia López, okay? Ustedes dos, Laura y Claudia López, se van a quedar en la main room. ¿Ok? ¿Sí? Así que cuando les llegue la invitación, no se vayan a unir en el caso de les llegue. ¿Sí? ¿Sí? Los demás, los voy a unir en pairs. No sé si alguien tiene algún inconveniente. Creo que Edgar, usted tiene inconvenientes, parece con su audio, ¿right? Entonces, um, eh, lo voy a dejar también en el main room. ¿Ok? Edgar y a los demás los voy a poner en pairs. Si alguien tiene inconvenientes, Avíseme para, pues, ponerlo, pues, uh, dejarlo aquí en la sala principal. Yes? Okay. Give me a minute because I need to open the breaker room. Um, breaker room. Okay. Karen also. Very good. So we have Edgar and Karen. Edgar and Karen. Okay. Los demás creo que todos, pues, tenemos, tienen audio y... Yeah, right. That's the thing. I have 18 minus 2. I have like 14, so that means like 7. So it's 7 pairs. Okay. Here we go. Just let me check the options. Okay. Five minutes. Okay. Very good. Okay. So let me check. 
Okay. Okay. Give me a minute. Oh my gosh. Okay. No, voy a cambiar. Voy a dejar a Andrea Landos en el main room porque Claudia ya la seleccioné. Claudia, I'm sorry. Oops. Right. Entonces, Andrea Landos se va a quedar usted en el main room. Ok. Um, sorry, ok. Um, ok. Very good. A minute. Um, ok. Let's check. Very good. Um, eh, ok, Ivania and Leslie. Ok, let me see the other one. Oh, no. Y quiero ver quién más. Lisbeth, a usted también la voy a dejar aquí en el main room. Ok, Lisbeth, sí, porque los demás de sus compañeros no pueden ocupar oh, el micrófono. Ahí no. Van a estar también de oyentes. Y usted va a trabajar with Laura and also with um, Andrea Lando. ¿Ok? Yes. Ok. Perfect. Ok, everybody, on the, on the screen va a haber un pop-up message. Usted se une and you practice the conversation. Cambia roles, right? Voy a dar, verifique el time so you can practice as much as possible. Yes? Very good. Let's begin. Yeah. There we go. Please join with your partner so you can practice this conversation. Okay, you can practice right now, Laura, Andrea Landos, and also uh, you, Lisbeth, okay? Leslie, hello, Leslie, how are you? Hello, teacher. Ok, parece I'm que su compañera de trabajo es... Um, eh, Ivania, pero creo que tiene problemas con el audio, así que la voy a enviar con otros compañeros, ok? Ok, teacher. La voy a enviar con Alison y Ana Marisol. Ahí les explica para que practiquen las tres, ¿yes? Perfecto. There you go. En el WhatsApp la mandó. Ah, ya, ya, ya. Ok. Ya veo muy cel. Quiero ver. Mm, por eso voy a poner, tengo la cámara apagada porque con el cel estoy yo. No tengo compu, entonces ahí voy a practicar. Ah, vaya. Ah. Para ustedes dos primero, Laura y usted. Vale, ¿Quién es? I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big farm. ¿Qué va? ¿Qué van ocho, ocho minutos o ocho segundos? No sé. <laughs> okay. 
Carolina, ¿entienden lo que van a hacer? ¿Y eso no? Yes. Okay, I need to practice, okay? Practice the conversation, please. La, sí. la, la imagen está en el chat de WhatsApp. Yep. Uh, yes, teacher. Perfect. Thank you so much. Eh, voy a empezar yo entonces. Bueno. Really? Yeah, most families in China have one only child nowadays. No I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? Que a mí no me da la opción de compartir tampoco. Hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? You good? Es que aquí estamos que quiero compartir pantalla, pero no me da la opción, entonces, y como la compañera tampoco puede revisar el, el chat. Oh, o sea, se lo, va, se lo voy a compartir ahorita, no worry. Ah, ok. okay here we go. Ok, gracias. Bueno, compañera. Okay. ¿Quién comienza? Comienzo yo si quieres. Eh, está bien, comienza. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, um, um, only two. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one child. No good days. I didn't go that. What about you, Marcos? I come from IB family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? No, not really. A lot of families are smarter. This, these days, bad, big families are green because you have lost a birthday present. Okay, you join, yes. Hoy cambiamos, hoy cambiamos. Usted es Marco y yo soy Meili. Sí, ahorita empiezo. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Melly? Actually, I'm an only child. Or child? Really? Uh, yeah, most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Whoa, is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you had a lot of birthday presents. Thank you so much, very good. Um, you have a few mistakes, like for example, actually, 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 child, I am an only child, only child. 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 And then we have the expression nowadays. 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 Okay. Nowadays here. Okay. Nowadays. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Keep practicing. Thank you. Very good. Keep practicing. Ah, yo con Laura. 
Y lo del FBI. Sí, sí, okay. por supuesto. Ah, ok. okay yeah. Pero me voy a meter en el chat. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, I am a honey shield. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one shield, no way, no way days. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? No, really, a lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. Thank you so much. Very good. Laura, just we have the special child. Child. I'm an only child. 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 But the rest is perfect. Child. Okay. Child. Empieza usted, Laura. Okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Maya? Actually, I am only shale. Really? Yeah, most families in China have only one shale nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcus? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? No, not really. A lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you get a lot of birthday presents. Okay. You, did you practice with Andrea? Yes. Yes, teacher. Come on. Oh, that's that's wonderful. Beautiful. Great job. Okay. You just we're just waiting for your classmates so they can join us. I think the time is all it's just one minute left, or maybe like 40 seconds. Once they join us, we will have some help, some participation from some of you, and then we will move on to the next thing for today. Thank you so much. You're doing it very good. Do you have any question about some vocabulary that you have in this conversation or everything is great? It's great. Yes, very yes. good. We have something about, I didn't know that. Yeah, that is simple past tense. I didn't know that. That is something about simple. I didn't know that. Um, China, actually, Remember that actually is like la verdad, right? It's not like actualmente, it's not that. It's just like, oh, en verdad, or something like that, actually. Okay. Most of your classmates are joining the main room. Okay, I think all of you practice, right? We're gonna have Claudia. Lopez, Claudia, who was your partner? My partner is Brenda. Okay, so Claudia and Brenda, ready? Okay. Please begin. Permítame, teacher. Okay. Comienzo yo, Claudia. Vaya. Bueno. How many brothers and sisters do you have daily? Actually, I am only shield. Really? Yeah, most families in China have only own shield nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? 
I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you get a lot of birthday presents. Thank you. Can you switch roles, please? Okay. Um, how many brothers and sisters do you have, mainly? Actually, I am an only child. Really? Yeah. Most family in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marco? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller this day. But big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. Thank you so much. Okay, Claudia. Pronunciation mistakes. We have actually, actually, child, nowadays, nowadays, and birthday, birthday. Okay, just check that pronunciation. Brenda, we have pronunciation mistakes with really, really, smaller, smaller, actually, actually. And then we have child, child. The rest, everything is perfect, people. Okay, Thank you so much. Uh, we're gonna have one more participation. We're gonna have you, uh, Lorena. Thank you, Lorena. Oh, no. Yes, Lorena. Yeah. Thank you, who's your partner? <laughs> Stephanie, parece no me acuerdo. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so Lorena and Stephanie. Okay. Yes. How many brothers and sisters do you have mainly? Actually, actually, I am an only child. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have one have only one child now nowadays. I do not that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you get a lot of birthday presents. Take a change, Ross, please. How many brothers? How many brothers and sisters do you have, mainly? Actually, I am only shy. Really? Yeah, most family in China have only one shy, no face. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have two brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days, but big families are great because you get a lot of birthday presents. Thank you. Uh, Lorena, just pronunciation with child. Child. I'm an only child. Also you, Stephanie, child. And the last expression, okay. uh, Stephanie, we have birthday, birthday presents, okay? That was very good, everybody. Thank you so much for participating. We're gonna have the next beat. Oh my gosh. No. Que paso, que paso. Que paso, que paso. Whoa, 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 whoa. Give me a minute. Que paso aquí. Que paso aquí. Oh my gosh. Oh, give me a break. Okay. Give me a minute, people. I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus. 
Let me, I need to show you something before we, before I take the attendance. Um, I think it's this one. I think it's this one. Give me a minute, please. Give me a minute. Okay. Talk about quantifiers. When we don't know the exact percentage of something, we use words like some, most, a few. Stay and learn more quantifiers and how to use them. Quantifiers. All families have only one child. Nearly all families have only one child. Most families have only one child. Many families are smaller these days. A lot of families are smaller these days. Some families are smaller these days. Not many couples have more than one child. A few couples have more than one child. Few couples have more than one child. No one gets married before the age of 18. Notice how these quantifiers have an estimated percentage. If you want to make reference to 100%, you may say all, and then you work down the scale depending on the percentage you want to refer to. Follow me in this example. Nearly all women work nowadays. Nearly all, quantifier. Women, plural noun. So in other words, all quantifiers come before plural nouns, except no one. No one gets married before the age of 18. No one, quantifier, gets the verb. As a tip, ask your teacher to remind you about count nouns so you are able to use these quantifiers. Okay, so this is the chart about quantifiers, as you may see on the screen. Um, we have this quantifier and we use them according to the context, all, nearly all, most, many, lots of, some. Here you have like a, como un medidor, right? Like, so you can figure it out the way we use these um, quantifiers according to the context. Not many, a few, um, few, okay? What do we have here? The grammar for is about Después de este quantifier vocabulary, tenemos un noun que es plural. Families, families, couples. Solo en este, que es no one, vamos a utilizar un verbo. No one gets married before the age of 18. No one pays, I don't know, for the rent before 18, let's say. Yep. So we use this quantifier to communicate how much is something, okay? how much is something. And that's the way we use it. If we use all, that means 100%. Nearly all, like 90%. Mass is around 70 or 75. Many, like 60. A lot of, like 50. Some, like let's say, 40. Not many, like 30. A few, like 20. Few, like 10%. And 0% is no one. This is the way we use quantifiers in English. Again, you need to be careful with the context you're using according to the quantity you want to talk about. Yes? Um, this video, you can find it in the website. Okay, so you can check the website, the platform uh, que tiene ingres corporativo, so you can check the video as many times as possible. And also you have the exercise available over there as well. Okay, don't forget, you stay in casa, tiene que trabajar los exercise and also the material that you have available in the website. Okay, 
Um, I will say the attendance one more time. So when you hear your beautiful name, say present or I'm here. Let's begin with you, Alison Celaya. Alison. Ana Marisol Zamora. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Andrea Marisol Represa. Present, teacher. Thank you. It's nice to have you one more time. Andrea Vanessa Landos. Present, teacher. Um, Barbara Cabrera. Brenda Castro. Carolina Present, del Carmen teacher. Perez. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Claudia López. Present, teacher. Thank you. Uh, Cristina Monge. Cristina Monge. No, okay. Daniela Asensio. Edgar Portillo. Present. Thank you. Ernesto Ventura. Griselda Moreno. Um, Ivania Mendoza. Jennifer Torres. Jennifer Moss. Jennifer Marroquín, Jocelyn Mancía, Karen García, Carla Melissa Colocho, eh, Laura Molina, Present, um, Leslie Orellana, Lisbeth de Rodríguez. Thank you, Lisbeth. Lorena del Carmen Hernández, Lucía Elena. Here, teacher. Mayra uh, Méndez, Raúl Reyes, and Dalila, I'm here. Okay, Karen, thank you so much, Karen. Carla, thank you so much. Thank you so much for letting me know. Again, remember that in the website, let me see if I can show you the website really quick. Okay, give me a minute. In the website, as you may know, this week, oh, what is that thing? Okay. In the website, okay, you have the different sections available for you where you need to work, right? We have section one, two, three, four, and five. This is the section we're doing. You have two things, the grammar part, and then at the end you have it like a final exam, right? Yeah, you need to have this material ready or finish uh, this week, okay? So here you have the different materials, right? Uh, here you have the videos also that I show you sometimes, yeah? So you can recheck the videos, watch them again, and you have some exercises, right? Where you need to work. Here we have this thing about family, which is the first thing we saw in this week, right? So you need to complete the vocabulary based on this one. You have the vocabulary here. Yes. Um, and then you have again about using questions with present simple. Yes. Oh my gosh, I think this is pre no, present continuous, I'm sorry. This is present continuous, right, where you check that. Yeah, so don't forget that you need to check the exercises. Here you have the uh, the conversation that we practiced today in Paris. Uh, also, you have the quantifier video. We have this quantifier grammar part. Tomorrow, we will continue practice with this quantifier and we have some exercises. And here you can check, right? You can have these exercises, so you can check them. Remember, these exercises are just for practice. So no importa si usted se equivoca the first time, you can do it as many times, right? Until you get it. Hmm? Oh, Jocelyn, thank you so much, Jocelyn. I got you here. Thank you so much for letting me know, okay? So people, uh, we're gonna stop it here. Thank you so much. Don't forget to practice your English. We will see you tomorrow with the last class of this module. Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye -bye. Good night, people. Bye-bye.